Greetings. In this video, I am going to show you how you can continuously deploy a website from GitHub to Netlify. GitHub is a Git repository hosting service. While Git is a command line tool, GitHub provides a web-based graphical interface. It also provides access control and several collaboration features. What you see here is a repository. A repository is an index of all the files associated with a given project. We are going to host this document today which is an HTML document over Netlify. Let's head over to Netlify now. Of all the options that you see here like GitHub, GitLab, Bitbucket, today we are going to go with GitHub. So click on GitHub. Authorize Netlify to have access of your GitHub account. No harm, I can totally guarantee that. Now that you have given required access to Netlify, it will head over to its dashboard. You can simply push code to your GitHub repository and your website will be deployed. This is your dashboard where you will see your deployed websites. In order to deploy your first site, click on new site from Git. We have to connect to a Git provider, so connect with GitHub. That's since we are deploying a repository from GitHub only. If you want, you can totally go with others. Note that the repository that we are going to deploy today goes by the name of Neclify-Tutorial. Click on GitHub. Provide the required access. Earlier, we just logged in using GitHub. You are not giving Netlify any sensitive data with this one. Click on Authorize Netlify by Netlify. We have been authorized. Now you have an option to give Netlify access to all of your repositories or only select repositories. I am going to give Netlify access to one repository that was Netlify-Tutorial. The one that we need to host. So now I get an option to select any of the repositories and I am going to select Netlify-Tutorial. Now you need to enter your password to install so I am going to skip that step. With this we have successfully installed Netlify in our GitHub account. Now select the repository that you want to host. For us, it's Netlify-Tutorial. Note that here you can choose any branch to deploy. I am going to deploy master branch. Since this is a static website, we don't need any build commands, so directly click on deploy site. Our site is now being deployed directly from our repository in our GitHub account. And we have successfully deployed it. We have a temporary site name and a site URL. Let's change that. But first, this is your website dashboard. As you can see, you can set up a custom domain as well. Now click on site settings and let's change the site name and the URL as well. Under the site information tab, check the section site name. Click on change site name and set a new name. I'll name it testing1311. You can see the new URL under the input box. Save the setting to change the site name and the URL. We now have the site name and site URL of our choice, testing1311.neclify.com. If you want, you can have a custom domain as well. Let's click on the URL and check if it's working. As you can see, Neclify is now hosting our GitHub repository. And all of this was within 5 minutes.